Do you ever just think to yourself, man, adulting sucks sometimes. Adulting is difficult. <laughs> you know, I tell people all the time, you have to make a lot of decisions um, as adults. Um, you know, would you rather be right or would you rather be happy? And one of the decisions I ask people a lot of times when it comes to um, healing from betrayal, especially if you're going to reconcile, but even if you're not, is do you want to be married to your story or do you want to be married to results? Because listen, we all have a story. We were hurt. We were betrayed. We were devastated. We were crushed. We were ravished. And that's true. Boy, is that true. We are hyper vigilant. We are, you know, many uh, are, are insecure. Are, I mean, oh my Lord. We are a completely changed creature, a completely changed human being. Not for the worse, especially if you heal. But anyways, do you want to stick to your story? Do you want to be married to your story? Or do you want to be married to results? Everybody has a story. And everybody thinks their story is the exception to the rule. Let me tell you about my spouse. He did A, B, and C and was caught doing this. And now, now you know, let me tell you what she did. You're not going to believe this. We all got a story. We all got a story. Do we want to be married to our story? Do we want to be married to results? It's very, very easy to hold on to the story. It's very tempting to hold on to the story because we get a lot of these uh, false rewards. You know, we get to be the victim. We get to feel bad. We get to feel as if, uh, you know, we get all the sympathy. And we should in, in some capacity, but we can't live on that economy. That kind of, our economy should be striving for the future. Now, if you're with the person that you're reconciling with, I hope they can meet you there and they can offer you a safe place to land and they can give you what you need to move on. And if you're not reconciling with the person, then these are things and decisions that you have to do yourself. Heal yourself so you're not sticking to your story. Because again, we often have to think to ourselves, do I want to be right or happy? Do I want my story? Or do I want my results?